Yep, I think maybe that's for that. Jamie Sheldon in the house. What's up, my man? All us Jamie stick together. Let's go. My man here. My man. Oh, oh. Dustin Jella. This, this is a good match here. Dustin Jella in the red. Jamie in the black. There we go. There we go. Yeah, I'm going to go big screen on this here. Let's go. Let's go. Let's see what happens here. Come on, Jamie. One foul on Dustin. Sometimes you don't even need to do any talking here. It, it, sometimes it's just, the match speaks for itself. This is uh, one of the premier matches I've been waiting, interested to see. Dustin looking strong. Jamie Sheldon is his beast. So let's see. Let's see. Not been in the house. They're going to strap it off. Let's go. I feel like I read my book. Okay, I believe I'm after this one. So. All right. Very good. Well, good luck. Let's go, let's go. All right, let's go. There they go. There we go. Hey, they're going. They're going at it here. This is a match. This is a good match here. Dustin looking good. Dustin looking good. Jamie's trying to make a move. They're going back and forth. This is going. This is going all day. Oh, here goes Jamie with a power move. With a power move. And he got it. He got the first one. First one for Jamie Shelton. That was a good match. That was a great match. That's just the start of the top, you know, best of five here. So here we go for the first one. Yeah, he does. Jamie does have ridiculous side pressure. We're going to be able to talk to him after. All right, guys, don't forget that we are at the Ricky House here in Pennsylvania. Don't forget to go over and order some drinks, order some food. Don't forget to check out the apparel table that the beautiful Black Scorpion is on limiting, I believe. Don't forget to check out Greg. Who is yeah, we have every bit of about 300 people here. So. Definitely. It's, it's, a, it's, it's, it's a big thing here. It's a big thing. There we go. They're going to get ready here. They're going back up for their second match. The second of the best of five here. Uh, first one went went a good bit. They're sitting there and they're he's getting coached up right now. Dustin is getting a little bit coached up. Who do I see? Who's gonna snap with me? Greg, will you snap with me? Come on, you're gonna snap. Right? We got on, people snapping. We got people snapping. doing their thing. So we got everybody here. On, everybody in the world here is just about putting on. You know, putting this live. So we are doing it as best we can. You can definitely find us on Roku.
the Roku channel, the Northeast Streaming Sports. We're going to be doing this uh, a number of different events here. Yeah, I'll bring you on. What's that? What's your name, bud? <laughs> hey, Daniel Worley. There you go. Daniel Worley. Yes, sir. There you go. I'm sorry, man. He's already here, so that's why I'm in bed. No, it's all good. So what do you think? So obviously, Jamie's side pressure is, is pretty intense there. What can, what can Dustin do to kind of combat that? Uh, I don't, I don't think that, uh, I don't know him enough to know if he can make adjustments, but that was exactly what he needed to do, a smack a hook, no strap. Um, so obviously that pretty much answered what I think. If I was him, at this point, they were kind of pulling both equal. So I've got to try and do like a quick hook or, you know, no strap, trying to change that angle up a little bit. But okay. All right, back to action over was that just two fouls? I was two fouls. I think they're going on three fouls. Okay. I trust the right now. All right, so Jamie just took two hits inside. Let's see what he does to adjust. Jamie's gonna hit. There we go. Okay, here we go. Oh, nice. Austin takes that one. That one. A lot of pressure. Big jump from the start. Jamie has to get into straps. He has to be able to use the strap. Um, uh, so it'll let him apply his lat to control and coming to his side. He's not going to be able to use his hand. He seems to be really, really strong there. Impressive. Impressive. Yeah. I, I, his side pressure, his side pressure came pretty strong, but I guess he, when he had it in the strap, you know, I guess he's able to use the strap to his advantage there. Yeah, because yeah, the strap will allow Jamie to not just use his bicep and hand. You know, but he'll be able to use his lat to keep it towards him. That way he's not coming over here on his side. Let's see what happens here. Oh, he, he, uh, he's trying to get. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Dustin takes the second one. Got to figure out how yeah. to get that. You know, hey. Got to get to the strap. So right now it's Dustin two to one over Jamie Sheldon. Very, very impressive, right? Yeah. Yeah, a lot of strength. I, I, I mean, I've seen Jamie do a few matches before. Just Dustin came in real strong, so. Yeah. Yes. That's an option where he's at to get out and get the strap. Yeah. Well, he just did. Yeah. Well, he just did. Yeah. Yeah. All right. He's got two more. Uh, I would have to get to the weight somewhere around 190, 200, right? I mean, well, maybe closer to 200. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I think yeah, yeah. I heard uh, Jamie was like 203. So they're probably that 205, 200. Uh, wait. Uh, he's, he, and you can tell Dustin's a little top heavy. You can tell he's. There it is. He committed. Okay. Oh, nice. 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 Good job. Wow. Yeah, just, Dustin was just too strong for Jamie Shelton. What's up, Craig Soublair from 